living it, the weaving, and then on top of that, the, the construction of houses. Which houses? Which houses we have? Thatch houses. Because I showed that's one I took. I took that in, when I was in Ghana. Lots of people said, I thought that was a slave. I said, yeah. Who you think built them? Exactly. Who built them? Yes, the enslaved peoples that came from this region that were accustomed, they are accustomed to having them there. So, another connecting link. Okay. So we have, and the other thing about the maypole, we, we asked, there were supposed to be four men and four women dancing. The male, the king, uses, leads with the red ribbon, and the queen with the white ribbon. You know that in Akan religions and so forth, they talk about those colors being very strong spiritually. And I said, going back now to Egypt, the, the connection between bringing North and South together, red and white crowns, bringing them together. So there's a lot of background history that we have, at least I found, that have made a connection for us that we could say full steam ahead locating the Barbados land ship. Aha. I'm driving by in the car and you slow down and traffic. And I said, great, get your daily Susu here. Susu, picture. I asked the taxi man about it. What's the Susu? He said, well, I could explain it to you. For a month, has 31 days, right? So you could give your monies in for a month, 31 days. At the end of the month, they'll give you back 30. The person who collected will keep one. That is how they made their little commission. But you will get back your money. This is the same thing that the land ship did in Barbados during those hard times. They would save up, they would put in their monies on Friday nights, and then at the end, they would get it back. Or at special occasions, they would get back monies, especially then in Barbados, when we had like the ex exhibition. People wanted their monies to buy the children's shoes and dresses and so forth. So that is when it came in really helpful and handy. 12 cents a month. Oh, I see. I gotta come and do some interviews. I really have.